This is Kevin with OGO, and we're going to talk about how to power the OGO Origin. Uh, it's a 12-volt system, so there's usually two ways to power the, uh, the toilet. First is through with a power adapter. Uh, so if you have a wall outlet access, then you'll need a power adapter. We do sell one on our website. The important feature is that it's worth, or it's rated for 10 amps of current. Uh, some power adapters typically are like 1 amp or 3 amps, and it's not enough to get that motor as much power as it needs. So 10 amps, 12 volts is the output. That's the important part of a power adapter. Common way, depending on your build, is to use the power cable that comes with the unit. So it's in that small parts bag. Uh, it has open wire leads. So these are basically just stripped back. Depends on how your build set up. You might have a 12 volt circuit that you can tap into. You might need a battery like this one or like this one. Um, these are deep cell cycle batteries. This one's a lithium ion phosphate battery. Um, it has, I think they're open spade connectors. So we crimp on these little connector types, although you might need more of a ring terminal connector or a more open spade. Um, however, your battery has a good contact is what you might need to get your power from the 12 volt system into wherever your power sources. So for a power cable, the polarity matters significantly or your toilet won't work. The negative has to go on to the black and the uh, positive is on the red. So I have this battery set up just like that and it would be center positive. So the negative is actually around here and the center is on the inside. That goes into the power jack and that should turn the fan on immediately. You should hear the fan. It is very quiet, but now, if you listen very carefully, you'll hear the fan, or if you press the button, you should hear the agitator mix. So that would be how to power. And of course, if you have any questions on how to power, definitely reach out. That's what we're here for.